All right, Youngjin, welcome. Thank you for joining us. I know, I know there was a lot of traffic on the way down Saturday. Hit the uh, freeways. That's tough. Okay, we have, we have a little issue that we have to situate. So we're gonna go ahead and do that with Youngjin Jung. But uh, until then, um, that was the yellow card. A deduction of uh, ten points. Per round, round for Yongin Kim. And here we go. Let's see, let's see how this changes everything. Well, let's see how this changes things. Yeah, and of course, World FC has the accumulated uh, point scoring system where as fighters score points for takedowns, knockdowns, a dangerous, you know, kind of position submission. It's going to be very, well, it's going to be impossible for him to come back, you know, a 10 point deduction each round. He's going to have to finish this fight by knockout or submission. He's going to get the win, take gun. Okay, oh, looks like an unintentional poke. Check him out, we have to check out that replay. <coughs> yeah, that, okay. was just, that was totally unintentional. Oh, it was, <laughs> from that angle, it's like, bleep. Yeah. It was unfortunate, definitely. Just taking some time out. Doctor's checking out his eye. I mean, hopefully he's okay to continue here. We've had a few, had a few eye pokes earlier on in the night. That second bout of the evening, key one. Yeah, that was finished. That, was, that in a crazy I mean, knockout. That was like, what's that? You know, three eye pokes. Three eye day. pokes. Yeah. It's like, they knocked him out for it. So I remember the Albert Chang versus uh, Shinji Sasaki. Three low blows in one day. Yeah, that and was, then Shinji, that was a long Shinji fight. like took 15 minutes. He took the full 15 minutes, and that match was. I mean, you weren't here for that one. That we were, me and Yongjin were. We were sitting there going, "Oh my god." We had nothing to say. <laughs> Now he's he looks fiery. He's, he's got a lot of a lot of movement. Trying to throw his opponent off. Take out some little slower. Nice counter. Yeah, just looking to counter, looking to stalk his opponent. Okay, see Yuki Ito, he's he doesn't have to be so aggressive. He knows that. He's he's already got this in the bag. Even if he just survives. Yeah, I mean he doesn't want to risk too much, does he? He doesn't want to leave his chin out there and get caught. Because that's exactly what uh, Tegan is looking for. Yeah, that, that's his only option to win this fight, really. Good, good. Actually, really, strategically really good, Yukito. Three minutes remaining in the first round. Okay, Tegan needs to get moving. Maybe he just wants to take it to the second round.
taking his corner saying that uh, Yuki Ito is avoiding him because he's uh, intimidated. Oh, there's a little right. Uh, Yuki definitely the flashier fighter. Gets a little, a little rough around the edges, but he's going forward. He's gonna, he's gonna try and finish this fight. I think he's gonna be a little bit more urgent. Remember, only two rounds. This one, he's gonna have to put his opponent away to finish, to get the win. A minute left. A minute thirteen left. Throwing that two to the body quite often. I'm not sure if he wants to bring. Whoa, and a nice body kick there. Maybe he wants to bring his opponent's guard down and then counter to the head. Try and catch him. Tekken seems pretty unfazed. He just keeps walking forward. Yuki just dodging the fence there, getting out. He coming in right now. He's pick, picking things up right now with 30 seconds left in the first round. Yagito going for a takedown. Uh, and only, well, he's got one leg. Got a single, yeah. Now looking to go towards the back. He's got those long arms. Just short hooks from the clinch position. Oh, there was a low blow. Oh! Oh! oh. Yuki Ito! Oh. No. It what, came what? from the low blow. It came off the low blow. But the referee didn't see it. But Tekion's mistake was that he looked at the referee. He looked at the referee like, are you gonna are you gonna give me a break here? I just got just got low blowed. The referee missed it and uh, Yuki Ito just carried on, obviously. As we've said before in previous events, you know, you can't look at the referee when you get low blowed. You gotta carry on unless the referee steps in. When you see the replay, you'll you'll see it. Oh, I yeah, I completely missed that, so. Yeah, it was a it was a knee, it was a knee, I believe. Right in the uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, you got to give it to Yuki. Okay, I mean, let's take a look. Finish the fight. That was the. That was. That was the low that blow. Was that was a low blow. Yeah. Okay. See, the referee uh, said carry on. Oh, well, yeah. We got to see it. Okay, we need a different angle. Better angle, really. <laughs> I'm not. It's if, hard that, to call. if that was the. Uh, if that was the knee that. That was the low blow. It might want to be one of those like raising type of low blows, you know? Yeah, I mean the ref was just looking to carry on. Because okay, so basically that cup, it might have hit him on the way up. Right. I mean, let's see the replay again. Come on. Yeah, I hope we can see it again. But um, yeah, Tekion definitely just looked at the referee momentarily, like you're gonna stop this, and then he just ends up getting caught, gets put down, gets finished. But Yuki Ito, now 3-0, and oh, you gotta give it to him, he, although he'd already pretty much won the fight on the scorecards, he, he came out, he went forward, he tried to finish it, it was entertaining. And it's a TKO for Yuki Ito, or Ito Yuki, obviously um, Tekken is not happy right now. Replay! <laughs> Come on! Okay, I guess we're not getting a replay. Okay, we'll find out later on <laughs> what exactly happened there.